2020 was a tough year for cosmetics in the UK as successive coronavirus lockdowns, remote working and a ban on gatherings lowered demand. But with social interaction back on the cards as the country begins to peel away at layers of restrictions, makeup sales and in particular lipsticks are rebounding. Natalie Powell reports. Pucker up because lipstick is making a comeback. Since non-essential businesses in the UK reopened in April, beauty and cosmetics retailer Space NK has experienced a surge in demand. We have had a phenomenal response to lipstick sales. We've seen them increase by over 300%. Uh, we're really seeing our customers come back in and shop the category now that they can get out and about more. 80% of those purchases were made in store, and on the company's website, makeup has been the most popular category. Department store John Lewis is reporting a similar trend with a 178% rise in lip liner sales. Last year, overall makeup sales fell 40% and lipstick purchases halved because of remote working and COVID-19 restrictions. The pandemic knocked $800 million off the value of the UK's luxury beauty market, with brick and mortar stores closed periodically during lockdowns. But as we all get back to socialising, demand is bouncing back and makeup sales are seeing triple digit growth, according to the NPD group. Unsurprisingly, a lot of that is in products worn above the mask. We've also seen a fantastic response in eye makeup as well. As you can imagine, we have our eyes exposed. Um, mascara actually trended incredibly well throughout the pandemic. It was one of the subcategories that did continue to do well as a product that people still put on for their Zoom calls. But demand for lip products hasn't really come as a surprise to many consumer analysts due to something called the lipstick effect, seen during recessions or economic downturns. The lipstick effect basically refers to the fact that when people can't buy their usual everyday luxuries, they usually invest in smaller luxuries. Economically, we have the information to say that people do buy lipstick. So if you can't afford your usual Chanel bag anymore, you'll buy a Chanel lipstick. And retailers like Space NK expect demand to keep climbing as consumers kiss restrictions goodbye. Natalie Powell, TRT World, London.